Hey everybody, welcome back to Family Firearm Reviews. Today, we're gonna look at the Phoenix Arms Deluxe Range Kit. Now this is a 22 LR handgun. It is the HP-22A is the model number for it. It is on the budget end, but I'm gonna say it's a kind of a great little firearm for people that are beginning out shooting. Um, it is only 22, so it's gonna have low recoil and be great for you, know, you to get your kids, maybe the wife, the girlfriend, somebody started on that's never had a firearm before. Uh, some of the really neat features about this are it comes with a locking case, so you can lock the case itself, keep it safe up if this is your first firearm or something that you don't have a gun safe yet, the case can actually keep the firearm safe. Now, if we wanna get down to some of the nitty gritties, you're looking here, it actually has a changeable barrel. The first barrel is three inches. Now you could actually swap that out for a five inch barrel. Now you get this with this deluxe range kit, but it also comes with all the cleaning accessories, gun oil, that's all inside of this case for you. So you don't have to go out and buy other gun cleaning materials. Everything comes with the firearm for the first time. Now, if we wanna get down to the specs, like I said, we have a three or a five inch barrel. Uh, it does come with two 10 round mags. Even though this one has that little extended grip, there's no more rounds in it. It's just 10 rounds is just a little bit extra grip for someone with larger hands. Uh, we're looking for a total length of 4.1 to 7.5 inches, depending on the barrel we place on this firearm. It does weigh 20 ounces, so it is a little heavy, even for this uh, low caliber. That's just gonna help with recoil. It does have an adjustable rear sight. It does have a thumb safety for the right-handed side. If you guys can see right here, it's gonna be a little bit better for people out there. It is single action, so you do have to rack it back. If the hammer does go forward, it will not fire. You have to recock that hammer. Now, another thing that's a little quirky about it is the slide will not release unless you do have a mag inside of it. So the slide won't release, the safety won't come off until you have a mag. Now, like I said, it is single action. There's the hammer. So even if you would try to fire it now, it will not fire. The hammer has to be back, right? So that's another little safety feature there. Um, if we're looking, we're going about 3.9 inches tall, and we are only about three quarters of an inch in width. So just a small little handheld firearm. So something great just to get started on. I would definitely say we're going to test this out and see how this works, see how the different ammos go through it. We're going to run 100 rounds through it today. We're going to run some Thunderbolt and some CCI standard velocity. Now that we've covered all that, we're going to take it out to the range, and we are going to throw 100 rounds down the barrel and see how it works. So let's check this out. Now that we've got the Phoenix out here on the range, we're gonna shoot this 22. i I'm gonna start with the regular mag first, then I'll run 10 rounds in the extended mag. We'll get our first thoughts of, the, of this fire on. Well, that wasn't a good one. Oh, safety was on. So this does not have last round, last round lock back. So that's something we're gonna have. Oh, I just love doing that. Didn't really hit anything, but it was still fun.
Next, we'll give our final thoughts with these first shots. So here we are, we finished up, we put 100 rounds through the Phoenix Arms 22, and you know, outside of the sights being a little hard to acquire because there are no like white, white dots or any, any kind of color there, it really wasn't a bad shooting gun. We didn't have any malfunctions. Uh, the whole 100 rounds went great. So I think as a starting firearm, if you're just getting into shooting, if you have a family or you, and you want to get somebody interested into shooting, this range kit might be right down the road for you. Like I said, it's not a big investment. You don't have to go back and buy all the cleaning supplies because they are already uh, inside this box. They come with the kit. What do you think, Lauren? I think that in between takes, they didn't see us fight over whether we're getting rid of it or not because I love it. It's super light. It's easy to fire. It's not that inaccurate. If you put some work into it and you train yourself on those sights, you're going to have a nice little gun. Uh, easy to rack. Like you say, for anyone who's just starting out or training, it's really going to give you everything that you need. And there's nothing wrong with that. So the price point on this, again, uh, brand new. We're looking around $250 to $300, depending on where you're at. And that's for the whole kit. If you just want to buy the firearm itself, minus the kit, I think you can pick them up for $150. Um, used, if you look at these, they're going anywhere online. I found them for about $200 to the $250 range, the whole deluxe range kit used. So it isn't a big investment, and I think it would be good for a first-time shooter or someone starting out shooting. Again, we appreciate you guys coming out and checking out this channel. Uh, hit that like and subscribe button if you like the video. Also, if you guys have any info or any experience with the Phoenix Arms 22, go ahead and throw that down in the comments. We'd love to see your experiences too. All right, thanks. thanks see you guys, guys again. Thanks for watching our video. Make sure to hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our future videos. If you liked the video, make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Comment below. We want to hear from you. Get more content from Family Firearm Reviews by joining our Patreon and checking out the links in the description.